What's up guys, this is NoBlast85 and today I'm bringing you my thoughts on the Sonic Project 2017 trailer and I'm not gonna lie, I am not super big on this trailer, not not because it's the game or something, because we actually really didn't get any gameplay, we just got a really awesome CGI trailer, it's just that it has a darker tone and I don't know, a lot of the other Sonic games with a darker tone usually don't end up being the greatest story wise because Sonic Adventure was somewhat dark but then again the story in Sonic Adventure was kind of weird so, yeah, that was kind of odd. And then Sonic Adventure 2, it had a, um, a darker tone than Sonic Adventure, and the story just didn't make any sense at all. And do not get me started with Shadow the Hedgehog. So, again, darker toned Sonic stories, I don't know, they, they're not the greatest, but usually the gameplay makes up for it. So, this is the Sonic T Project 2017 trailer, and as you can see, you have Modern Sonic and Classic Sonic right there. So, they look like they're running in uh, City Escape. That's what a lot of people say that is the city escape and um i know our lack to lack made a theory that this is city escape and since sonic generations has sonic messed up hey hey no. sonic meeted up with uh classic sonic and he said maybe that it altered the the, the past or something i don't know it's kind of weird so that's why sonic maybe went back in time and not classic sonic come to the future i don't know it's something like that that was a relaxed lack theory and i don't know i i kind of agree with that and it's and i i guess what it's kind of so it's kind of like Sonic Generations 2. I kind of called it a little bit, not really. I just got, I just knew it was gonna be similar to Sonic Generations 2 because you get to be Sonic, modern, modern Sonic, and classic Sonic, so that's pretty cool as well. And uh, again, there's Death Egg robots in the background, and they, they're not really Death Egg robots. They look like it, and they're bigger than the Death Egg robot, but they look very similar in terms of models, so they probably just reused a few models. And hopefully, this game runs 60. 60 frames in uh, 1080p because you know it's next gen Xbox One, PlayStation 4, and the NX. Can I just mention that as well? And so um, that means that it it should be pretty good in terms of frame rise and graphics and everything. So yeah, it's also to know that we are getting uh, somewhat of a really high quality game on the NX. So that means the NX is going to be all sorts of powerful. So yeah, I actually really have nothing to say on this trailer. It's kind of you don't really know much, and if there's a trailer doing gameplay, then I'll definitely do another opinions video on that. But from so far, the trailer, it looks alright. That's all I gotta say, really. I mean, again, I don't, I'm not really liking the darker tone, but then again, Sonic Colors and Sonic Generations, they were very good games, so I wouldn't be surprised if this game isn't terrible. So, then again, tell me what you guys think in the comment section below, and I, I think Crush 40 is actually doing a soundtrack for this game, too, so it's gonna be so good. We're gonna have another classic, like Live and Learn and Open Your Heart. Oh, that's gonna be so cool. Cool. And uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching and please like, comment, and subscribe. Again, tell me what you guys think of this trailer in the comments section below. And I'm finally done for the day so I can relax. So uh, yeah, have a dang day.